So that's our start in the Yorkshire Beast. A 5.20 start, we think, we hope, around about 14 hour in total riding time. I've not got my GoPro because I didn't charge it properly last night. Right, better get cracking. So with us we've got Adrian, Gid, Dan and Calvin right at the top. The first beastly hill done. It was a bit of a brute. We got caught up with some other guys. And I hate that because you get in a group and if they're going slower than your average cadence, it just feels all claustrophobic. So just tapped away from them. Get a bit of clear room. Legs feel good. Yorks are really just never disappoints. Stunning. on a little bit to get to the aid station first because I really need to go to the loo. Oops. <laughs> I thought if I just put the pace on a bit it'd take my mind off it. It has a bit. Not much. Thought I'd share. That's better. So we've done 50 already. It's taken us about three hours, 22. Just tapping out really. So beautiful, so beautiful. So we've just cycled up the Devil's Chimney. I think that's one of the steepest I've ever climbed. So that's us halfway. It's taken us, what, six hours? Six hours, 18 minutes. Yeah, good times. And the weather's been amazing. We've been really lucky with that. How are you feeling, Gid? All things considered, pretty damn good. I'm feeling all right, yeah, good. Does it feel Just... like nothing to you? No, no, I definitely respect this, you know. You'd be stupid not to, right? Calvin, it's like nothing to you. Never, never take the mick out of a 200 mile ride. No. First 100 done, more sun cream put back on, more chamois cream put back on, and we're off on the road again. Second 100. Ready for it, kid? Think so. Good man. miles to go and we're just about to head into some of the hilliest parts of this second 100. We're all feeling pretty jovial which is good and the weather's on our side and uh, yeah so far I think the boys are quite happy. We've done 165 Come up to the last aid station. Can I be a liar to say that I wasn't feeling this? And Yorkshire has just given us the most amazing scenery. Well worth a visit. 
So that's us at the last feed station and Calvin's just said that someone's back already and they did it in 11.51. It's mad, it's bonkers. Um, so we've got 30 miles to go and it's definitely time for coke. Yes, the compared to Dragon, yeah. uh, it's different. You know, this is like everyone else. It's brutal on the climbing. I mean, the Dragon's brutal, but you had a bit more undulation. But this, blimey! Final time on the scores: fourteen hours and eight. But I haven't stopped the Garmin yet, and we've been back a bit. So I think it was roughly. 14 hours on the dot, which is what we were thinking of right from the start. We were like, we reckon we'll do that in 14 hours. That was good. And in the last 20, uh, Adrian, Dan, and myself teamed up with some guys and we just did a nice little bit of through and off. So we sort of tapped it out around about sort of 2021. And uh, the guys tried to have a little sprint at the end. <laughs> Anyhow, what a great day, really enjoyed that.